Another important thing to talk about when you're mixing drinks is what's going to make them sweet. We have several sweeteners here, uh, starting with one I'm sure everybody knows. Uh, there's one important thing to remember. This is Domino's Super Fine Sugar. Uh, you can use regular sugar. Super Fine will dilute a little bit easier, and it's hard to dilute sugar in alcohol or in cold liquid, so Super Fine can help. But you should never use confectioner's sugar, which has cornstarch in it. You don't want that in your beverage. Next we have Orgiat, or as the Italians say, Orzata, or we call almond syrup, which is just that. It's uh, an almond syrup or almond flavored syrup. The only thing to look for is something that's ingredients whose names you recognize, and hopefully almond is near the top of the list. Uh, here I have a cane syrup, which is just sugar juice before it's refined, bleached, or anything else. So you wouldn't have to reconstitute this with water. You could use it straight or dilute it a little bit. Uh, at Little Branch, we use a simple syrup. It's a slightly dilute simple syrup to mix all of our drinks with because it's sugar and suspension ready to go. We know we're going to get the same uh, amount of sweetness in each drink. Uh, we have honey syrup here. The only difference between this and the honey you have at your house is that we add water. We do so so that we can pour it quickly and get an even measure quickly because we're serving a lot of drinks to a lot of people who are thirsty and waiting. We also have uh, ginger syrup which we use to make our homemade ginger beer instead of a ginger ale. All that is is fresh ginger juice and sugar to form the ginger. And this will give you a bright, very spicy ginger beer. Uh, you can also steep or make a ginger tea or any number of different things to make your own ginger beer or ginger ale. Or there are plenty of really nice ginger beers on the market if you don't want to use a large commercial ginger ale. Uh, last but not least, we have uh, grenadine. Our grenadine is made here in-house. It's uh, grenadine is from the French for pomegranate, so it should be made with, if not exclusively from, pomegranates. Ours is ex exclusively pomegranate and sugar. It's a reduction of pomegranates uh, with sugar. If you want to make it at home, uh, you can take fresh pomegranate juice and reduce it by half, and for every 24 ounces of reduction, add one pound of sugar, and that will give you a quart or liter of grenadine. With all that sugar, it'll keep in your refrigerator for over a month, and you can use it again and again. Uh, you can also use uh, pomegranate concentrate, which is found in, widely in uh, Middle Eastern markets across the U.S., and just a spoonful or so in your drink would replace this, as well as some simple syrup to achieve the same results.